Why, hello everyone! Welcome back to Skyrim, where we left off. We was in this cave, kind of, sort of. Now we have to find where we need to go. Did we explore this whole cave? Ah, oh, that answers my question. No, we have not. You're as Guys, if y'all have never seen an anime before, Die! you know, like a good anime movie, I would recommend y'all to watch this movie called Angel Fall. 8. I just saw that recommendation on YouTube, and my god, can I just say, it's absolutely fantastic. Fall, damn you! Now, I'm gonna watch it with my lover tonight, but if he don't want to, you know, I could ask one of y'all to watch it. Alright, let's see. There we go. You know, the more you shoot me, the more I heal. Like so found a naked guy, naked chest. I think that's everything. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go explore some more. What we need to do before was go in a particular place and time. I just forgot. Okay, let's see here. I kind of forgot where we needed to go. Hmm. Where do we have to go at? And where am I? I think we was going to go to Riften to bring the gem. But once again, where am I? Oh, here we are. Oh no, we are probably was going to go heal. Investigate the boss cam. So if I look this way, this, no. Yeah. It's one of these two. Nail. I think it's the first one that I steal. Or maybe it's that third one right there that just pops up. There's a campsite right here. We should make it day, but the vampirism will probably mess up our stamina again. So. I forgot in this game, can you feed on people when you vampire? Because I remember in Oblivion, you could have. One of my favorite stuff doing. If y'all know. There's someone there. What? Are you. Excuse me? What do you need? Who are you looking for? We're looking for information about a woman, a foreigner in these lands. She's a red guard like us. We believe she may be hiding in White Run, but we're checking everywhere to be sure. Uh oh. Farewell. What do you need? Yes. Need something? Uh. Guys? She's right there. Are y'all blind?
Guys? Huh? Need something? Hmm? Mm hmm. Until next time. Hmm? Hey! Be careful! Get out of here. Yeah. I should have come here. Run up this. You're free, lady. Go! Run! Yes? What? You're dead! No witness now. <laughs> he has a woman outfit on. What? Come, my children. We'll go. Have we been to Solitude? I even forgot if we've been there. I'm gonna have to text my Thomas and tell him, Honey, I need some information if we've been to Solitude or not. Then he'll be like, I got you, hon. Let me go back to your video and watch. Stop that. We'll not have this foolishness. Wait, how do I go up there? Is somebody right in that boat? That would have been cool seeing that. Hopefully I'm going correct. I don't think I am. Maybe this way. Okay, no, I don't think so. Okay, so this way? Here it is. Oh yeah, I don't think I've been here. I don't remember entering the mine. Hmm. I gotta sit down for this, because I don't remember entering through a mine. I don't think I went in here. I don't remember. God, it's so frustrating. And it's super dark in here. Let's let me open my map and check. I haven't discovered this place yet. Okay, so I haven't been here yet. Interesting. Traitor, you betrayed us. Get on with it. Hang on, hang on. Somebody's gonna get murdered. I want to listen. Oh no! Where's this people get that's arguing? Oh bloody hell, why don't you tell me that is freaking from Skyrim? Is the other place safe to Skyrim then this one below say to Skyrim? Are both of them to Skyrim? I don't believe that. Ah oh, Lord. Bring me back inside so I could see this. Wonderful solitude. See what's going on in this crib. So solitude is a major shipping port in an important family. 
In addition to doing regular damage, shock spells also deplete. Okay. Now, what was these people that's arguing? I don't understand. What are they? Position. Get on with it, traitor. I heal them. Ulfric Stormcloak escaped the city after Ooh. he murdered High King Tori. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He Traitor! There was no murder. Ulfric Lion. challenged Tori. Stand I cannot bless you. What you yeah. Go! Don't get scared of all. Yeah. Oh God! One people. Got one war? I'll give you a war. By the queen alive. It's a beautiful morning. Hey, hey. Did he free though? I couldn't see him. Can we still fight him? A lot more pain. Oh, yeah, can you see back up? The Yasana is tossed from the side. Such a gruesome battle! Hang on. Where is he? I'll deal with this one. Fall down! Fall down, you! Fuck! You're here! Relax, my children. There's another one. No, you're killing Jerry! Jerry! Oh! Hi, my children. It's time for y'all to relax. If he didn't, it's fine now. Never should have come here. Javi, relax. Javi. I'm getting out of here. Javi. Javi, young man. Young man, relax. Relax, young man. Okay. Woo! What happened here? Javi? Relax. And I may still show mercy. I'll have you in this damn game. You think he doesn't want to give me mercy anymore? Fight. Then we will bend your Get will. This should be good. Jabri, relax. Jabri. If I had to find every single spell to make her relax, I will. Hang on, let me see here. Javi, I need to chill. My money's on the big one. Okay. Javi. Oh. Okay. What happened? What happened? Okay, you stay back there, okay, Javi? <gasps> Help me!
uh, guides. Oh, I don't know what happened there. Ah, oh, my good children now handle me that way. Okay. Now that we have enough fun, let me load up a save from previously. Let's see here, guys. Ah, uh, okay. I guess this one? This one should be good. I mean, this is when everything happened, you know. I doubt for sure if I, you know, try to save him. Probably could save him. There's like a 50 50 chance. Where am I? Ah. Get on with it. Shut up, you old man. I'm gonna kill you next. What's the entrance? Pardon me. God might get nervous. Ah. Uh, I think I expected more. Is he dead? If you're heading to the Blue Palace, you might want to rethink that outfit. Waiting. You wouldn't be a sellsword, would you? I have a little problem you could solve. You, huh? Yeah. Need something? Okay. Did he die? A man opens a gate and they cut his. Not head right off. now. Doesn't seem. Ragvir. Right why did it have to be like this? Okay. We're gonna make it daytime now because you know it's still nighttime and I want to see all the stores. You know the two busy shopping people heads off. Are you still here, Grandpa? Spare some gold for a veteran? Here, have a coin. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. It's best you leave me. You're as good. You're as good as He doesn't watch at me! Kill you! He doesn't watch at me! Babuga! Never! Guys. I should Go three world! You will learn today. Could never catch me. I'm fast as fuck, boy. I shall treat you true power. Power that will make you go insane, my brother. Power Time that will make you regret missing with my kind. Yeah. Power. But fuck, I mean Jerry's! <coughs> oh my god. Right now, huh? <coughs> yeah. Oh, it's gonna be the damn you. No sign of him. I know what you're thinking, Jack, what the hell are you doing? I had a twitch and they provoked me. It shouldn't have been like this. That's as best as I can say. They shouldn't have provoked me. As for now, let's continue on. Spider Queen is relaxed. Let's go inside here and see what this what is up in this joint. I say what what in the bot. Come on in. Let me know if you need anything, or take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. 
Oh, okay. Where is this a seat by the fire? Hello, yes. I'm the Dean of History and scribe work when I can find some quiet time. Hello, I'm sitting by the fire. <coughs> Is it this fire? If you need a good rumor or two, I think I can oblige. What do I see that? That's some big ass shells. Hello? Oh, hell no. You. I have no business with you. Leave me. Go away. I have more important things you. on my mind right now. Welcome to the Winking Skeever, friend. What have you got Take for sale? is useless. Thank you. Remember the winking skeever next Fuck time you. your foot sore. Fucking asshole. Sat in the fire, but no. Here, old man, get drunk. Can you spare a set? Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind. Yeah, fuck yourself. Guys, I honestly don't know why, but he triggered me. So, like, legit. Oh, what delight. Another charming customer. Oh, really? Oh, let me just drop everything to help you. I'd like to make an investment. <gasps> Excellent. I think you'll be glad that you made this decision. One second, I'll invest another time. Let's see what you can do with 500. Thank you. I'll be sure to put it to good use. Now, talk nicer to me. Only when you're around. The rest of these fools I can do without. Oh. Okay. What have you got Let's for sale? Let's see if we can't find an outfit that suits you. Oh, thank you. My spider queen has been dying for a new outfit. That's all. Oh, I'll take this. I like all of these. They look nice. Do you, I look like a servant to your lady? I don't have no children, unfortunately. They all died. <laughs> I appreciate the outfit. Or the necklaces, because they... You have a lot of stuff now. Wow. I guess that investment really did come in handy. Thank you. Finally. My bad. Welcome to the center of the world, or at least my brother Erica's world. So Erica is your brother? Yes, my older brother, and the person you probably want to be speaking to right now. But really, since Torig's death, Falk Firebeard wields the true power of the Jarl's court. My brother is nothing more than a pompous little fop. I'm leaving all this story. Y'all two are annoying little bitches. We'll speak again bitches. later, if we must. Well, the other one got a little bit more nicer since, you know, I invested, but still. Divines bless you. May the ground you walk quake as you pass. You have I'm no not idea. Interested, Jari. It doesn't matter how many times you have. Let's see what's in here and what this guy has. If he has something that we could use, then it will come in handy. <laughs> Sorry. Beren said you got here just before the ex- I just stole that bite. I saw you steal that! I'm so sorry. Huh. You know, you've got a certain fire in your eyes. 
just like my beer and... Please, feel free to look around. We've got a bit of everything. Oh, yo. Okay. Excellent. I think you'll be glad that you made this decision. I'll invest. Thank you. I'll be sure to put it to good use. Um, what have you got? Actually, what are you at? No. That was an ugly affair. High King Torig's death has turned the whole town on its head. Between you and me, he wasn't even that good a king. All of those rambling speeches about the Empire this and the Empire that. I see. Baron's my husband. He works the forge up at Castle Dower. I barely see him nowadays, what with him filling orders for the army. Hmm. Can you show oh, me your whales? A bit of this and a bit of that. Okay, nothing there. Do you have any healing? I'll take the healing. Because you know those healings does come in handy. I'll take all the ingredients because some quests require them. Too bad I don't have a buy all button. Come in handy. I got some things for so. I could use that for decorations, I don't know. Let's see here. What else do we have here? Come back to bits and pieces anytime. You look new. I'm new too. I think we could be friends. You're passing through solitude? Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground, or just left lying around in someone's house. I bet the two of us were very alike. So why not take the next step? We can help each other. My sister Deja and I are treasure hunters. We like to collect things. I knew you looked like a clever one. With the war, many more ships come through these docks. Loaded with weapons and pay, but few people and they pass through dangerous waters. We have an interest in one of those boats, the Ice Runner. The Solitude Lighthouse will be guiding it in, but if its fire were to go out, the Ice Runner would run aground. What an interesting idea. I think if someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. Yes, if someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. Don't worry about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for the heroic rescue from their sad crash. It would be best if we spoke little until you've completed your task. I and we back, guys. Sorry about that. Done. The game kind of died. Anywho, where we left off, we were talking to him. We agree with him. Yada yada yada. Now, what we came in here to, to do was to join. In the Bows Club. Wherever that is. And that's our parent. 
Maybe it's this way? I don't understand why I had to go. Maybe it's this way. People throw tomatoes at you anyway. I'm away. Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. Hey, wanna play tag? Five, four, three, two, one, go! <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you going to come and grab me? They say our big storm club murdered the high king. I'm the spider queen, young lady. You won't be able heart. to grab this too quickly. What is this? Hey, wanna play tag? I'm already playing tag. I don't wanna talk. If you don't want to hear about the dragon. Okay, but if you don't want to hear about the dragon. dragon? Uh-huh. I was in the beast attack. He attacked from the mighty above. He came striking down with a heavenly flame of hell. I say hell. I lost my eye because of that beast. Really? Was it big? Did it breathe fire? I it breathed the most fires, fires, fires thing ever. It took my legs and one of my last testes. Oh, wow. I knew it. I knew they were real. I have to remember to tell Papa. I tell him to fear the Pirate King Tor! Go! Okay, now that that is done... I thought adventurers were supposed to look yeah. tough. Hey, wanna play tag? How about you? I you wanna play tag with me? Five, four, three, two, one, go! Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore. Hey, Robbie is a bitch. Not. You can't catch me. I'm too My fast. papa says I'm gregarious. Just like him. He says I mean smart. But my brother says he's wrong. Is she following the little boy around? I'll take it they're brothers and sisters, yeah? Hmm. Oh god, young man. Need something? Young man? If I father her, surely me run. Need something? Hi there. Come back. Need something? Sure, whatever you say. Very fun playing with y'all. Now I have to be on my way. Now guys, that story that I just told that little girl, if you add the theme of pirates and stuff, that will add that will be so excellent in that. Welcome to the Bard's College. I'm the headmaster here. How may I help you? I would like to know what kind of rates do you have? Always a pleasure to meet a prospective bard. You should be aware that many apply, but we accept very few people. When possible, we ask applicants to perform tasks the college needs completed. In this case, I do have a task befitting an aspiring bard. What do you need from the Spider Queen? Elisif has forbidden the burning of King Olaf, a festival put on by the Bard's College. We need to change her mind. Okay. To convince her, I want to read King Olaf's verse, a part of the poetic Edda, the living history of Skyrim. Unfortunately, the verse was lost long ago. And that's where I came in? That's yes. 
according to Giraud, our history's keeper, the portion of the Edda dealing with King Olaf might still exist in the dead man's respite. What? I need you to retrieve the poem. As you wish. Oh! Ha! Oh! See, guys, it's always good to travel. That's tremendous! I have to admit, I, I didn't fully believe it still existed. Now, let's let's take a look at this. Very well, go ahead, my dude. Oh, no, you can't oh, turn on by no. it. Oh. Well, th this won't do at all. <laughs> look, the, the copy is incomplete. It's aged to the point that parts are unreadable. Oh. Yeah, that's what happens when it's older. Um, what does that mean? It's old, my dude. You really want to answer? Okay, go ahead. It means I can't read it to the court. Without the verse, I won't be able to convince Elisif of the importance of the burning of King I did my Olaf task, festival. though. Now let me in this damn thing. If she team. isn't convinced of the festival's importance, then she won't reverse her decision to stop the effigy burning. It means that the burning of King Olaf, which the Bard's College has held for time immemorial, won't be happening. Can't we just make up some missing parts of the verse? Make it up? That doesn't seem appropriate. I suppose I could copy his style based on what you brought me, but I have no idea what happened in between these verses. We can do this. What's the first oh, verse? Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed oh, betrayer. God. Death dealing demon and dragon killing king. Your legend is lies, lurid and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex, a con for the ages. King Olaf was Olaf One Eye. He famously I don't remember captured if I did this the dragon before, Numenex and took him to the dragon's have. reach. What, are you going what to did we say to really you? happened? I'm thinking of joining. Okay, let's see here. I hear they're looking for scouts. I find that highly unlikely, but the court will love it. Indeed. Writing it in. <laughs> the Spider Queen is at it again. Olaf grabbed power by promise and threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant. Inspired and wicked. Strange. According to history, Solitude attacked Winterhold, but Asgir seemed to be saying Olaf reacted. What do we say happened? Ah, uh, let's persuade him again. It's in Dragon for me. Oh, that is exciting! You better believe it, my dear. You better. Sure, the court and the Yarrow oh! will love it. I'm, I'm writing it in now. I'm getting hyped myself, so just go for it. Is that it? It has a few final lines, but that's all we needed to add. I need to head to court immediately and present this. You should come. Oh? Oh, I'll lead the brave. I'll kill them all. I mean, excuse me, young man. You got your face in my screen. Sorry, I'm... Young lady, will you... I do hope the court likes the verse. I believe so. Oh, come on, I'll walk side by side with you. It. Father says I shouldn't play with you anymore. Excuse me. We was playing tag. I do hope the. Are you gonna be saying that for the whole entire walk? I do hope the court finds it absolutely ambulance. I'll let him walk further ahead. That way you don't have to keep talking to me. Well, like, that would be better. Good sir. Hail Summoner. Conjure me up a warm bed, would you? There we go. Are you going to read it to them now? Oh, excuse me. 
I do hope the court likes the purse. I think we've done an excellent job of recreating it. I do hope the court likes the purse. I think we've done an ex- I think my voice is ready. I hope we've done this well. Go for it. But there's no one here. But there's one guard. Here's the people. Ah, Viarmo. I assume you are here to petition for the reinstatement of the burning of King Olaf festival. I am, Jarl. I wish to present King Olaf's verse from the Poetic Edda, recovered this very day from the Bard's tomb. You mentioned something that would convince us the festival should take place, but I didn't expect King Olaf's lost verse. Please proceed. O oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, death-dealing demon and dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex, a con for the ages. No shouting match between dragon and man, and no fire or fury did this battle entail. Olaf was Numenex in human form. On moonless nights, he would spread wings and sail. Olaf grabbed power by promise and threat. From Falkreath to winter hold, they fell to their knees. Oh, he's doing really good, actually. But solitude stood strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired and wicked because solitude would not soon bend knee olaf would hurt them while his status accrued he sacked winterhold in dragon form and bent their minds to blame solitude so ends the story of olaf the liar a thief and a scoundrel we of solitude commit to the fire in solitude, bards train for their service. They also gather each year and burn a king who deserves it. You have proven your point, Viarmo. The festival is truly a celebration of solitude and a condemnation of false kings. Nice. I thank you, and the college thanks you, Jarl. Furthermore, I believe that such a fine poem deserves some payment of patronage. The college will be very generously rewarded. Oh, thank you yet again. I will make sure our applicant, who was instrumental in recovering the poem, will be well rewarded. Make sure that she is. How do you know it's unbelievable? You have done us a great service here. I can't begin to thank you enough. No need to worry, young man. Does that mean I'm bow now? Soon. Soon. These things must However, be done properly. I you will be inducted as part of the festival course. itself. Too often I need you to go speak to Jorn. He was preparing the effigy of King Olaf. Tell him to finish the preparations. The festival is back on! The Empire is headquartered here after all. Okay. Bane Bryling, what do you have we to should have the festival the soon. How did the war the affect your college much? Uh, not much. But as a bard, I find the whole affair depressing. Ah, I understand. There are no heroes in this war, no winners to be had, and no real conclusion. If you want something a bard can dig into, look to the dragons. A thousand years from now, Skyrim will have changed rulers dozens of times. But the return of the dragons, that story is once in an era. The war has ended. After all, the general needs his soldiers out in the field. Fighting battles Not much, to be honest. Their return was a shock to us all. Gerard oh, Germain yeah. has some tomes about them in the library, if you're interested. Oh, very well. Style we need to talk about. Don't forget to speak to Yorn when you're ready for the festival. 
I will have my parade. Bloody well. Yes, my Yara. I don't know why he's saying I have to speak to him though. Oh, hello. Just tidying up. Hello, y'all. Be quick. I have little patience. If you have business, concerns. please see Falk Firebeard, my steward. Yeah, why did he kill your husband? Because that's what traitorous cowards do when they desire power. Ulfric Damn. coveted the High King's throne. He thought he deserved it more than Torig. And so he came before my husband and he... He shouted. With that terrible voice. Like something out of a legend. Or a nightmare. When Ulfric unleashed such fury... My husband, he... He simply ceased to be. That is all I will say. Or it grieves me to speak of it. Are you the queen? Well, are you the high queen of Skywind? Not <laughs> yet, no. Although it is true my husband Torig was the high king, and I am his widow. Now is not the time to lay claim to such a title. This land is riven by war, and her people suffer for it. The Stormcloaks are a blight on Skyrim, and like any blight, must be purged. Only then will I take my rightful place as High Queen. You do realize all this hate is not going to do me much. Hmm. A question I am all too familiar with. One my very thanes ask often. They worry that Tullius is so focused on the war that he risks forgetting what's best for our people. The real irony is that, while General Tullius is certainly no Nord, the people of Skyrim would be lost without him. Trust is always difficult, especially for my people. Yet we must trust in Tullius' leadership. For what other choice do we have? City we'll mm. need to visit each home for an assessment. Is it that time again already? Be well. Very well. Pray for solitude Let's and my husband. And make the arrangements. <clears throat> oh, do you well have done. business with the court? Very subtle. Feel I free to your... return to me with oh, questions. Oh, I'm sorry. I can Did I imply that you've been meeting for purposes other than court business? You must forgive me. Hold your tongue, wizard, or you're likely to lose it. Stop it, both of you. You're acting like children. I can't teach you, but I won't be able to how responsible. Okay, are you gonna teach me? No? Okay. What's wrong with your face, young lady? Thane Briley. Excellent. What do you have I think you'll be glad that you made this decision. The news Thank you. The I'll be sure to put it to good use. Uh, well, but you the there where the High Kings was died. I, don't I was, to my shame. The whole court was in attendance. I've seen much in my time, line. but that was a gruesome day. Why was he killing for Because Ulfric needed a symbol. Someone he could defeat that represented the Empire. The White Gold Concordat. The banning of Talos worship. Torig's father Islot had held Skyrim together for nearly 25 years. When he died, Torg became that symbol. Hmm. No, even after Islot died, the moot voted to make Torig High King of Skyrim. But Ulfric was at that moot, continually talking about Skyrim's independence in terms just shy of treason. May well be our I don't think Ulfric knew how much Torg respected him for that. If Ulfric had asked Torg directly to stand up, you, to declare independence, Torg might have done it. How lovely. Why didn't Torin ever declare independence? Because the Dominion is a sleeping beast that Skyrim cannot slay alone. Because many Nords are part of the Imperial Army even now. Because the food and resources we get from the Empire are important to our people. Because even if we can't openly worship him, Talos the God was once Tiber Septim the Man, and this is his Empire. And Torg wasn't ready to let it fall apart. How long have you been in the court? I was a member of the court during the reign of Torg's father. It was Torg who appointed Steward, me to the position. when is my appointment to meet with General Tullius? There are some issues we must speak about. You look very young, though, and a little bit glitchy. I like to think I've aged well. I'm certainly wiser than I once was. And I know when one should speak, Again? and Sorry when one that. should hold their tongue. An appointment with a Jarl? He serves in my capital city. What can I learn about magic? I have no time or patience for a student. Perhaps the College of Winterhold will grant you admission. He uses all of uh, can you teach me now, some now? To me in the slightest? 
No? Okay. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Do you have any books that I don't really have? It says all those. I never like leaving any of them behind. Thanks. Take care of yourself and always remember, the world is ripe with people. I'm afraid you must learn to accept this. If you have business, please address all questions to the steward, My steward. Folk Firebeard. Respect the law, and you'll have no trouble in Dragonbridge. Do you have business with the court? What will happen if the Empire wins the that war? That remains to be seen. By rights, she has a legitimate claim as High Queen of Skyrim. But we must have the support of the other Jarls for that claim to have any meaning. Should they accept her rule, we will have peace. Of course he does. What sort of a question is that? Maybe you've been listening to Eriker. There's been loose talk among some of the Thanes, and I suspect he's the cause of it. You'll pay those rumors no heed if you wish to retain your welcome in this city. Careful, I destroy she all may the young, I could do it again with we'll the Alice is the Jarl by right. And here in Skyrim, if nothing else, we respect the traditions of our father's fathers. You do well to remember that. Feel free to return Shut to your mouth. Questions. The Blue Palace is an open forum. Thane the Imperials are good for service. business, and business is good for Skyrim. I can always find time Okay, to who the hell sells a house door. in this place? With the passing of my dear husband, Torek, it's so good to see you again. Jarl has fallen to me. Take Keep your weapon Please out of your house. Don't Steward. start any trouble. No, they do. I get along good. just fine. Steward, when is my appointment to meet with Oh, hello. Just tidying up. issues we must speak about. Jarls come and Jarls go. But a good cook stays for a lifetime. And I'm a very, very good cook. Again, you can't simply cancel an appointment. With a Jarl? He serves in my capital city. I'm afraid he can. His authority comes from the Emperor. Who you also serve. I take your pie. Someday, I'll be a gallant heroine. Seville Stentor has a grasp of magical theory that I would never have expected from a human, even a Breton. Uh, whatever suits your boat, my dude. Anyway, guys, whoa, it's dog. As for now, we will have to end it there, unfortunately. But next time, when we return, we in solitude. We'll see what happens in here. As for now, I hope each and every one of you have a lovely night or day. Unless we have are. specific business. I'm not interested. So exciting when new folk come into town. I bet you've had plenty of adventures. Anyway, I hope each and every one of you have a lovely night or day, depending where you are. And remember, guys, that looks nice, actually. That, hello, man. I will see you all next time. Peace.